humanity, we have an automatic entitlement in order to have access to everything that will allow us to reach our fullest potential. That is our right as human beings. When that right is acknowledged, and when that right is understood, and when that right is respected, then an individual's possibilities are unlimited. And we begin to see the unleashing of the human potential. We begin to see the creative genius of everyone begin to make a contribution that moves humanity further so we can reach that epitome of our intellectual, our social, our political, and our economic possibilities. That's what human development is. It's when human rights are moved forward. It's when we are forged to higher heights. It's when we can dig down deep to that place where we find the very genetics of our humanity and use that in a creative way, in an ingenious way, in order to tap into that reservoir of unlimited potential. That's when human development soars. And when the combination of these two things come together, then we have what's called human justice. We have a world where everyone can aspire to be what it is they can be. That every thought they can conceive and believe they can achieve. That every individual and everything that they aspire to, they know that can be real because it's within their reach. Human justice is not some kind of abstract notion, but it's a possibility. It's when we all come to terms with who we are and why we are. It's when we align ourselves with our purpose. When we understand that each one of us has a contribution to make. When we accept the fact that we are each other's keeper. I am my brother and my sister's keeper. That we are because I am and I am because we are. We know is it South African proverb which is the very basic foundation of our humanity. I could go on and on. But I think tonight you will see in the Human Justice Award, everything that is personified in that concept for the next 10 years. The Center for New Leadership on Urban Solutions are going to be joining forces with large and small organizations like 1199 and small nonprofits and individuals and activists and artists and academicians and researchers, all of whom are committed to change, not just tinkering around the ages, right. edges, but making structural change that's going to move us towards right. that ideal that we know is possible. All right. All right. And so let me just simply close, let me close in the words that I'm known to close with, the words of El-Hajj Malik El-Shabazz, who said that we as a people have done so much for so long with so little that we are not qualified to do anything with nothing. <laughs> all right. So always shoot for the moon, because even if you miss, you'll still at least be amongst the stars. Thank you so much. All right.